Tonight, a former Lexington County Republican Party chairman is behind bars. This comes after authorities say he embezzled over $100,000. Uh, Rachel Ripp spoke with one of the organizations he allegedly stole money from. She's in studio tonight with those details. Rachel. JR Craig Caldwell was charged by SLED with two counts of breach of trust with fraudulent intent at values of $10,000 or more. Everyone I spoke with this afternoon tells me this news came as an absolute shock as Caldwell was well known and loved in Lexington. SLED has charged a Lexington man, Craig Caldwell, with stealing over $61,000 from the Lexington County Republican Party bank account and over $52,000 from the Lexington Rotary Club Foundation. These are two counts of breach of trust totaling over $100,000. According to the affidavit, Caldwell moved this money to his personal bank account before creating fake monthly treasurer reports for both organizations. Mary Gask is the governor of Rotary District 7770, which includes several Rotary Clubs in Eastern South Carolina. This is a very rare thing to have happen. It, it's, you just don't hear of this happening. You had a member come in that found a slip in the system and took advantage of it. Gask took office less than two weeks ago and says her predecessor was aware of the SLED investigation but felt it would be best handled locally. She says all Rotary Clubs operate under a four-way test. Is it the truth? Is it fair to all concerned? Will it build goodwill and better friendship? and will it be beneficial to all concerned. This guy that took the money did not pass the four-way test. We also talked to a spokesperson for the board of the Rotary Club of Lexington who did not want to speak on camera. He said the whole group was shocked when they learned about the stolen funds, adding that they had a lot of trust in Mr. Caldwell. He said their first goal was to get the funds back and reaffirm their practices to ensure this cannot happen again. He tells News 19 the Rotary informed its members Friday via email of the stolen funds in order not to jeopardize SLED's investigation prior to their announcement. State lawmakers that serve the Lexington County region were also surprised. Senator Katrina Sheely sent News 19 this statement saying, I was devastated to hear the news about former Chairman Craig Caldwell today. I hope that there will be a resolution to this issue for all parties impacted. We need to keep them in our thoughts and prayers. House Representative Chris Wooten also sent News 19 a statement, saying, I am not aware of the details at this point. I've always known Mr. Caldwell to be a good man, and if the allegations are true, I am as shocked and surprised as everyone else. Now, according to both sources we spoke with, the former Lexington Rotary Club board member and the Rotary Club governor for Eastern South Carolina, the money has since been returned to the club, but the crime still stands. Caldwell is currently being held at the Lexington County Detention Center. In studio, Rachel Ripp, News 19 WLTX.